said that RCA said you want to see a reaction from the players, and since then it's seven unbeaten in the league. Yeah. Well, we've certainly had that. Um, we seem to do that throughout the season. We'll go five or six games, lose one, and then go on another mini run. And fair play to the players, like, because we beat a, a lot of decent teams on the way. Do you think especially pleased with uh, Saturday's performance, the best away win of the season? The first half, we were as good as anything I've seen in the Northern League for a long time. Um, keeping the ball, passing it quick, and uh, most of all, when you're on top of teams, you put your chances away, it relaxes everybody, and players want it, everybody wants the ball, and everybody enjoys it. But it's, finishing your chances is what it's all about. You know. And that's what we've done, it was great. Yeah. There's been plenty of times this season that teams have been two goals ahead and let the opposition back into it with a sloppy mistake or anything. Were you, were you pleased with how the saw the game out on Saturday? Well, for me, throughout the season, apart from maybe the first month after that, our defence has been top draw. And they're all experienced lads and, and they're really tight and they're a good unit. We've changed it now and again, other players come in, but they're equally as good, so if you look at our stats, I think we're down there with the amount of goals conceded, which is any team, if you're not conceding, you don't have to score many to win, so it's the main thing for us, we're not conceding, great. So. And it's four clean sheets in a row now, and that's with Mark Peck injured as well. So. Yeah. Um, Mark would be a miss to any team, but yeah, we've gone four clean sheets against some decent outfits as well, and home away games, especially. Yeah, great. You, you can't ask for no more. If you're not conceding the defence, you, you can't say a lot to them. They're doing their jobs. Great. Obviously, Ashington's going to be a big test of the weekend. They had a cracking result last against Spenny Miller. Yeah, Ashington, I think, will be a different team than we played them earlier on the season when we drew with ten men. Up there. Since then, they've had a great run in the FA Cup, on, and they're still in the Vars. And I think with what they've acquired financially through the FA Cup, they've ploughed back into the team, and they've got some big names there now. And they're actually my fancy for the FA Vars, so I'm going to get myself a few shilling on them. But it'll be a massive test for us on Saturday. I mean, if they beat Spenny Moore. Well, they're not spending more up the Vars and they beat them at home last night 4-1, great result. We'll be up against it, but we've been up against it before. It's a first home game this year as well on a Saturday in the league. Yeah. Excited to get back to Miller Lane Park with a big crowd? Yeah, a big crowd would be great. I'm, I'm sure Ashton will fetch a few fans. I'd like to, for us to play as well at home as we have been away. The thing is, when you play away, teams have a go at you at their place and that's when we're at our best because we can get in behind. A lot of teams come to our place, close up shop, players on the break and it's difficult but we'll, we'll get on with it and I don't think Ashton will, I think Ashton will go, will go for it and, and if they do we've got enough, uh, we've got enough now we're not going to hurt them. And there's a lot of first teamers missing this one Saturday, like Melanie Jardine, Rum Gibson, are you expecting them all to be back in contention on Saturday? Oh, the, They'll all be back fit, yeah. Yeah. Well, they were all somewhere near last Saturday, but we decided to leave some out all together and just give some a little bit of a run. Um, I've fetched players but in the past. I've fetched them back too early, and it's turned, it's come back to haunt us. Like, so now I know I'd rather lose a player for two weeks than six weeks. But yeah, they're all back for Saturday, so we should be somewhere near. We've got a couple of that's unavailable, but that's what, if we don't have a decent squad in this league, you'll never do well. You can't run with 12, 13 players, you need 18, 19. Hopefully with the same quality that comes out and another one steps in. Yeah, that's, that's what we have got here, and we'll over the moon about it.